Welcome to NorCal Slot Car Scene. AFX recently introduced a red 1970 Chevelle Mega G Plus slot car. The detail on the car is what we have come to expect from AFX. The grill work is excellent and the paint stripes are crisp and clean. This is a clear series car, so there is a 3D looking interior. I do wish the wheels were not so plain, but a little work with a chrome paint pen fixed that. However, this review is not about the car. The difference between this and any other AFX slot car is when you go around to the back. The California personalized plate reads C-U-K-R-A-S. John Sucras was the most dominant racer in the early days of slot car racing. He made enough of an impact that Car and Driver magazine published an article in 1969 entitled Sucras, The Sound of Teenage Money. It was reported that John earned in excess of $30,000 barnstorming around the country racing slot cars. John also had a huge influence on HO slot cars. He was part of the design team that developed the original AFX G+. That inline design of the G+, revolutionized HO slot cars and is still in use today. He also designed the more recent AFX Mega G chassis. John even had a hand in the recent worldwide success of Division III retro slot car racing. We lost John in 2020. Now when you see the red Chevelle with the Sucrus license plate, you'll know why AFX chose to honor John. Known as John the Jet, John Sucrus was the first superstar of slot car racing.